In today's interconnected world, the debate between nationalism and globalism has become increasingly relevant. This clash of ideology centers around the question of whether nations should prioritize their own interests or work together on a global scale. Each side brings forth compelling arguments, nurturing a discourse that touches on politics, economics, culture, and identity. Let us delve into this debate and explore the foundations of nationalism and globalism, the benefits and drawbacks of each and their implications for our mod the world. Nationalism, in its essence, emphasizes the significance of a nation and the pride and loyalty its citizens ought to have towards it. Advocates for nationalism argue that focusing on national interests fosters cohesion, stability, and a strong sense of identity. They believe that maintaining borders and sovereignty is essential for preserving cultural heritage and traditions. For instance, proponents of nationalism argue that immigration controls are necessary to protect domestic job markets and national security. By safeguarding the interests of their citizens first, nations can ensure economic prosperity and maintain social harmony. On the other hand, globalism posits that nations should collaborate and transcend their individual interests to address global challenges collectively. Advocates for globalism contend that interconnectedness and cooperation among nations can lead to better outcomes in areas such as trade, climate change, and human. They argue that sharing resources, knowledge, and technologies can help alleviate poverty, promote peace, and advance scientific progress. Proponents of globalism believe that the well-being of humanity as a whole should take precedence over narrow national interests. From an economic standpoint, nationalism often advocates for protectionist policies, such as trade tariffs and subsidies, to support domestic industries and shield them from foreign competition. Nationalists argue that by prioritizing local businesses, jobs can be created, and the overall economic prosperity of a nation can be ensured. Additionally, they believe that by avoiding dependency on global markets, Nations can protect themselves from economic downturns and maintain stability within forces and attacks. Globalism, on the other hand, champions free trade and the removal of barriers to promote the flow of goods, services, and capital across borders. Supporters argue that by opening up to the global market, nations can benefit from the comparative advantage of different countries, leading to increased economic efficiency and specialization. They contend that free trade can raise living standards, create employment opportunities, and facilitate technological advancements through increased competition, innovation. In terms of cultural impact, nationalism promotes the preservation and celebration of a nation's unique traditions and values. It emphasizes the importance of language, heritage, and customs, fostering a sense of belonging among citizens. Nationalists argue that a strong national identity enables social cohesion and solidarity, providing individuals with a shared cultural foundation. They contend that cultural diversity could be threatened by globalism, which may lead to the erosion of traditional values and the homogenization of cultures. On the contrary, globalism promotes cultural exchange, tolerance, and understanding. Proponents argue that by embracing diversity and fostering intercultural dialogue, societies can benefit from a rich tapestry of ideas, perspectives, and experiences. They believe that openness to different cultures can lead to greater acceptance and coexistence, cultivating a global community with shared values and mutual respect. The debate between nationalism and globalism is not a simple dichotomy as both ideologies have their advantages and drawbacks. Striking a balance between national interests and global cooperation is a task that requires thoughtful consideration. In our modern world, global challenges such as climate change, economic interdependence, and the ongoing pandemic necessitate collective action and collaboration. However, it is also essential to acknowledge and respect the diversity and cultural heritage of nations.
In conclusion, the debate between nationalism and globalism represents a clash of perspectives on how societies should prioritize their interests. While nationalism emphasizes the importance of nations and their distinctive identities, globalism focuses on collaboration and interconnectedness. Each ideology has its merits and challenges, and finding a middle ground that allows for both national preservation and global cooperation is crucial. As we navigate an increasingly interconnected world, it is essential to engage in constructive dialogue and seek inclusive solutions that consider the well-being both individuals and the global community.